morning everyone and welcome to the third education and development talk um which is being hosted by university college cork so we'd like to say a very big thank you to them and thank you to michael and to kathy for helping us put it all together and organize it um as you know the first one was held in dublin second one was limerick now we're in cork there's nowhere else to go so we'd probably move back up the country again um but since limerick um we've been continuing to work actively in a number of areas um, our next, we've done April, June, September for the education and development events and the next one will be in February which will tie in with our first annual conference. Um, the article writing, writing forum um, has gone very well and has resulted in the fact that we have a number of articles which we will now be incorporating into our first bulletin which will be coming out at the end of the year, beginning of next year. Um, February is the month for, as I said, the annual conference and um, we'll tell you more about that nearer the time. We'll, of course, be looking for speakers, um, so you're more than welcome to, to put in a, a vote for that. Um, the Digital ELT conference, um, we've been working alongside the Learning Technology SIG from IATEFL and also MEI in helping to put that together and that will take place in November as it has done over the last couple of years. Um, I think most of you already are receiving our fortnightly newsletter with updates about what's going on, keeping everybody in touch. And as usual we've got our chinwag which takes place on Twitter um, every second Monday. Um, in addition to that, we said at the last event that we were now uh, an affiliate of IATEFL and we were following up on that and working closely with some of the other um, associates and affiliates in different parts of the world. Peter attended the IATEFL Poland conference and they hosted him and we'll be doing that and hosting one of their members when we have our annual conference in February. Um, I recently met with the president of ELTA in Albania and we'll be doing the same type of thing. So yes, we're growing in Ireland, but we're also growing outside of Ireland as well.